Um, I know that they, um, the first symptoms are like a fever, mm -hmm. headaches, and um, sometimes it can be mistaken for other things, but there's been a few cases of that. Um, and then more serious, I don't, I've been told that like you bleed from like everywhere, like yeah, your eyes yeah, and stuff, yeah, which sounds horrendous. Yeah. So, um, would you know what to do if uh, a friend or someone contracted Ebola? Not really, but probably Try I would and just contact <laughs> um, the hospital or something and probably stay away. Okay. Not in a horrible way, but so we <laughs> don't transfer like bodily fluids. Okay. Do, do you think UK <laughs> hospitals are ready or prepared to uh, fight the virus? Or I don't know, I've seen like mixed reviews in media, so I don't know if that's to scare us to realise how serious it is, or actually we are prepared or not. Okay, I'm desperate. I don't even know. And do you think that Ebola is 